and needed some coins to build that dream team you guys have always wanted, make sure to head on over to my sponsor, Buy Madden Coins. They have the cheapest, the quickest, and most reliable coins on the market right now. Head on over to Buy Madden Coins and use code PULA at checkout for 20% off your order. Hey, what's going on, everybody? It's Poodle back with another Madden Ultimate Video Guide. And today, I'm going over what you should be doing with your coins right now during the Super Bowl promo. I have not made one of these, I don't believe, for the Super Bowl promo yet. And guys, there's plenty to be doing. Super Bowl promo, I'm not going to lie, one of the better promos we've gotten this year. I'm actually really enjoying it. We're getting great players, great masters, a great amount of content, a great LTD, great solos. So, so far, everything about Super Bowl promo has been great. There's been great rerolls, there's been methods. And guys, it's, it's been hitting on all cylinders. We've got two free 95s. Well, actually, one free 95, one free 96 practically helps us get a free 97 like if you play it right with the coins i'm telling you guys one of the better promos this year a lot to be doing with your coins right now and currently i'm stacking coins to go ahead and pick up this tyree kill which i'll show you guys i'm doing another video i'm posting today you guys can see my method to get tyree kill pretty cheap um so check out that video if you haven't already or it might not even be up by the time you're seeing this so check that out in the future but you get the point guys before we get into this video make sure you're going to blow hit that subscribe button turn that naughty bub boys come join the family get the 20k as quickly as possible we're almost there we're, we're getting super close Guys, it's not that far away. Make sure to comment down below what you guys are doing with your coins right now. And make sure you give this video a big thumbs up. Can we get 500 likes in this video, boys? You guys have been going crazy. Support's been awesome. Keep it up, boys. Now, getting into this. First things first, what do you want to do with your coins right now? Guys, Super Bowl promo is finally introducing some endgame cards. Now, I told you guys, I like to spend my coins on endgame cards. That's just how I like to do it. That is the way I, I personally build my teams. Because at this point in the year, right? If you just start picking up willy-nilly all 95s you see, you're going to end up having to sell them. You're going to be losing a lot of coins at a point where things are kind of expensive. So I don't recommend you do that. So first off, as far as brand new endgame cards with Super Bowl present, they just dropped one, I believe. Now, I don't think Richard Sherman's endgame. I think his speed's too slow. You're going to have to upgrade him at least one more time. Tyree Kill is officially one of the first endgame cards in this game. Like, actually, like, you can have him the rest of the year. His endgame... I don't think you have to upgrade him. Guys, he gets human joystick, he gets 99 speed, 99 excel, and he can route run, and he can catch. End game. Have no problem with him the rest of the year as one of my He's gonna be on my, my team for the rest of the year. Tyra Kill is a must have, right? So I think if you have coins, you gotta get Tyra Kill. Now, I don't think you do it, I don't think you buy him. I will be doing, I will be posting a video later going over how to get Tyra Kill for either super cheap or damn near free or him and all the Nats for a good price. Now, make sure to check that video later. It's gonna come out around probably like. 3 30 4 o'clock ish eastern time now tyra kill is one of the end game cards you need now sherman if sherman had a 93 speed he would have been end game because you could have powered him up kept him up to like a 96 speed but his speed's too slow his stats are awesome they're so amazing but he's still one card away and i think the gilmore defensive player of the year will probably be better next week that will be coming out so gonna be waiting on that all these other cards none of these other cards are end game in my opinion not any of these other cards now super bowl so far though but that's that's expected right because these are pieces. The Masters are what we expect to be endgame. Now, as far as Super Bowl Pass goes, Gene Upshaw is an endgame as well. I don't think I don't think Gene Upshaw was endgame. Steve Young could be endgame. He could be. Like, if you guys just want an accurate quarterback with Dash and Dead Eye, you don't want to waste so many coins. Steve Young could be endgame. I do think though that I'd rather wait for the next Mahomes and or Lamar Jackson card or vice versa. So I think that's probably what I'm working with right now. But guys, now that endgame cards are coming, that's pretty much it from there. We're gonna probably get one more LTD that's probably close to endgame. We're probably gonna get a super bowl mvp that's end game we're gonna get nfl honor cards that are end game so now we can finally start picking and choosing what we want and just this is the point point of the year where you want to just start getting cards because like you can't keep doing like in the first few months it's cool right get a card sell a card get a card sell a card you if you can't i bet you guys if you went back and you counted all the coins you've lost in reduction and depreciation you could build another three squads it's that much you guys lose you don't realize it but you do so at this point in the year it, it's too much like 400k lose 40k on the reduction buy a car 500k lose 50k it's too much loss the best bet at this point in the game is like, okay, I'm content with my team. I know what I kind of like this year. Like for me, I know I want, I want a human joystick, a little small wide receiver. I don't do much possess. I don't, I don't do a lot of like contested catch. I do a lot of open passes. Tyree Kill, locked on the team. I can do that. Steve Young, he's great. He's borderline end game, but I kind of want a Lamar. I, I've, I've been doing really well this year with a really fast quarterback. He hasn't had dashing dead eye, and I think the next Lamar might actually get to dashing dead eye. So I'm waiting. He's going to get probably 99 overall powered up. So I want to see that card first. Once I see that card, I'll evaluate the rest. But it's getting pretty cool. We're getting to a point where we can start picking end game cards. Now, as far as team of the year goes, you guys were asking. I'd say only Aaron Donald's end game. Now, people were asking, why isn't Russell Wilson end game? He can be end game on a Seahawks theme team. But Steve Young's better. Mahomes will be better. And Lamar Jackson will be better. And the new Vic will be better. So it's like hard to say why is he not. He's not. It's not that he's probably a top five quarterback right now, but he's just not end game in my opinion he's that well he can be 
But again, it's preference, guys. Don't think that because I say this guy's more in-game than the other one doesn't make him in-game. But we're getting to a point where every car is going to be able to be powered up and kept up to 99 soon. So there's not much of a, differ a, a differential between other 99 cards. So you kind of can just pick which ones you want. This is what I like about Ultimate Team. At this point now, you don't have to just be like, you don't have to get the best overall. You have to get a guy near the best overall. You can come up to the best overall. And then he's pretty much that. Or you can get 99 overall guys, you can come up even more, and then their stats just can be, they become ridiculous. But those get very expensive as time comes on. So you guys really got to pick pick your poison. Pick where you want to spend your coins on. Now, as far as making coins, guys, like what should you be doing with coins? First of all, go get your predictor solo done. If you guys don't already have those done, they're super quick. I think it takes like 30 to 40 minutes if you play them straight. Get these predictor solo done and take them over to the predictor sets. I did make a video going over the best predictor sets to do and how to get tons of free coins out of this. Go check that video out. It was posted, I believe, yesterday. Probably my second video. You should probably see it on the top page of the channel. Get those done. Get your souls done, guys. There's just so many ways to make coins right now, as well as things to use them on. Now, don't go and burst all your coins, guys. I think Tyree Kill with the method I gave you guys is perfect. Kill a little bit of your coins, and then save the rest for NFL Honors. Because as far as Super Bowl right now, I think the only cards you really want for Super Bowl right now are Tyree Kill. Tyree Kill is the main one, at least. And then, I'd recommend wait for NFL Honors before you pick up any more Super Bowl players. Now, remember, there's more stuff coming out. There's the MVP. Now, a set that's getting kind of interesting that I might make a video on is this Super Bowl MVP set. I potentially might have a method to get this for pretty cheap. It really just depends. I have to go do the math on it first. I don't want to just, you know, drop the video without the math. As of, as of now, something that you might want to look into your coins on, this costs about, I believe, 1.7 million, right? If you get it for the right price. Now, you could all you could reduce it using my methods on Tyreek and Sherman. You could probably reduce this to about 1.2 million coins, which at the end of the day, that's not bad. If you get Hill, Sherman, Steve Young, and Gene Upshaw, and the MVP for 1.2 million coins, and then you could always go ahead and sell the MVP for like 500K. And then or even more and then you can end up getting it for like 700k you get a 600k card it, 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 it could be it could get real real profitable so i really got to check out to see how this works before anything but I, I i gotta do the math on it but guys this could be the best set in madden i don't know yet it really just depends on how we could work this gotta look into the math on it but something going to i just recommend you guys save some coins there's some great methods to be doing right now as well as a lot of things coming out now like i said what to spend on tyra kills he's a given sherman if you guys have the right niner scheme or seahawks team he's probably the best cornerback in madden right now but it really just depends i think he's too slow on a regular team but on a theme team or with john madden all those boosts maybe you can make him we can make him work i just think that he's gonna fall off a little bit i like what i like about tyra kill he's not gonna fall off he's gonna be he's gonna be the fastest guy on the field from now to the last day of the game and by the time people catch up he's just gonna be one of the fastest guys in the field right now he's the fastest then he'll be one of the fastest so tyra kill is a safe bet now we're gonna get some more super bowl players obviously super bowl mvp could be really cool plenty more stuff coming out i always love like i always say guys i build my team with the super bowl and the nfl honors those are all, a bulk of my team's always made up those players and a few of the team of the year cards but i probably tend to being aaron donald he's kind of the one that i really want from the nfl honors beyond that i'm kind of just content with uh, tyra kill and the nfl honors i probably want gilmore they're probably, probably gonna come out i probably want lamar jackson there's probably gonna, there's gonna be a cam newton more than likely there's gonna be some pretty cool cards for that and don't just spend it all yet because things will come down a little bit remember that now beyond this guys it's gonna be combine and theme builders and stuff team mvps i mean so spending your coins now makes sense you can get the players you want you can come up to a 99 and have fun with it and again as we get later into the year it comes to a point where people stop competing as much so you're gonna have fun now this is like kind of the time this is we're, we're leaving the phase of the regular season so you can really pick up your last few players because once we get out of the regular season a lot of the cards are gonna be legends like ultimate legends and uh, rerun legends like recycled and also don't expect too much beyond this as far as new modern day players like i'm telling you guys this is the final phase of the regular season and the well this is the final phase of the 2019 2020 football season that's that's this final phase so enjoy your coins while it lasts and make sure to go pick those coins with the predictor sets you can really reimburse yourself there as well as make some back and get your tickets guys your tickets are huge for getting these players for cheap make sure you get your tickets done and go get your nap players do not pick your nap players yet so you watch my video which you should be seeing shortly after this one so make sure you stay tuned for that but guys that pretty much sums up the video I think I pretty much covered what I'm doing with my coins right now. Like I said, I built my coin stack back up. I'm using it on Tyree Kill. I'm gonna, not much investments you can really make anymore, guys, to be honest with you. It's gotten gotten to a point where like, you really gotta search for them and not a lot of people have the capital front anyways to make the return per investment. But Super Bowl sets, guys, gotta be done. Super Bowl MVP set, very intriguing. Gotta look into that. Stay tuned for another video. I might be going over that in a, maybe tomorrow, depending on if I get the math right on that. But guys, that's about it for the video. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you're into the channel, make sure you go down below. Hit that subscribe button, boys. Turn on that notification bell. Let's get to 20K as quickly as possible. We're not too far off. Goal was end of February. I think we're going to blow past that. I hope so, at least. Comment down below what you guys are doing with your coins right now and what you guys recommend. And make sure to give this video a big thumbs up. Can we get 500 likes on this video? Noti Gang, if you made it this far, make sure to comment down below. Let me know you watched the whole video. And give this video a big thumbs up. That's about it, guys. Thanks so much for watching. I'm out. See you in the next video. Peace.